Insulin is a growth factor. Insulin makes cells grow and divide. There is no growth without insulin. Now, if you're a kid and you're growing, if you're in puberty and you're growing, if you're pregnant and you're growing, you need more insulin. So the phenomenon of insulin resistance, that is insulin working less well, is necessary to drive all of that growth because you need a high insulin level. But if you're laying down fat, that's the wrong thing to be doing with your energy, to be turning it into fat. That's the growth you don't want. But insulin is going to drive that growth. So if you're consuming excess or if you're consuming things that drive insulin, like refined carbohydrate and sugar, you're going to lay down more fat. And the higher your insulin goes, the more fat you're going to lay down. Worse yet, that fat then releases proteins that feed back on the liver and make your insulin work even less well. And now you've got insulin resistance and you're going to drive even more insulin up and more fat gain. So you get caught in this vicious cycle of more insulin, more fat, more insulin, more fat. And you can't get the fat down until you get the insulin down. So fixing the insulin resistance is job one.